Hey everyone, it's R. How's it going? Apologies for the mess in the background. Um, so I just wanted to do a quick update, which is going to be exciting because it's been a few months, and the last video is actually related to this. <clears throat> so I got a call, I guess, like at the beginning of October, and I totally missed it because I just didn't know that I got it, and it was, it was in regards to top surgery. So on October 18th, I actually saw my endocrinologist and found out that. I have an appointment for top surgery, uh, the consult at least, on November 24th, which is so exciting. Oh my gosh, what? So I'm just like going to Victoria in like 10 days right now, in 10 days on the 24th, which is a Thursday, and I'm pretty excited. Which also reminds me, I have also I have a fundraiser page that I'm trying to raise funds with. Um, I started a few months ago, and holla at the, everyone who's already, I you know pitched in some money, you, you folks rock, and I appreciate it. Um, my goal is $3,000. The reason why I'm saying $3,000 is because $1,000 is for a hotel. Um, I'm hoping to stay up there for a week, so the day before the day of, and then five days following, uh, just to, like, I guess, heal, and you know, in case anything happens, you know, within the first like five days, I guess, you know, um, and then like 500 for travel, which mostly is going to be the taxis and whatnot between uh, my hotel and the hospital, my hotel and the surgeon's office, um, and then my hotel and the ferry and then to, uh, from Victoria to Vancouver, and then the ferry, uh, I mean the taxi from uh, the ferry dock there to my place. Um, and all of that I'm hoping is going to be no more than 500 bucks. You know, like, I'm most likely not going to be doing a whole lot of traveling, like, post-op, you know, or, like, right after surgery, except for, you know, going to the surgeon's office and whatnot, so, you know, the most most of it's going to be coming out of the ferry ride, or the ferry taxis and whatnot, the taxis to and from the ferry, so, yeah, um, and then 500 for food, um, and that's basing it off of, like, 17 bucks per meal, um, and, uh, whatnot and so for like two people because I also want to make sure that the person that's coming with me also is fed you know what I mean um, and then <clears throat> 1500 I guess I think it was yeah 1500 or so or a thousand between a thousand and 1500 for like the other expenses that I might in, uh, face so like uh, what you would call it any like aftercare stuff you know, like I want to, I need like I want to need aftercare stuff, um, what you call it, rent bills for like a month or two or a month and a half, you know, uh, or like a month, um, and just like anything else I might have to, you know, endure during like the, you know, not going to work and whatnot, which sucks because like what what I do is like I I I work at a hockey arena and like I. I'm an event staff, and I am one of the quick service cooks, so I'm like one of the staffs cooking food, serving food, something like that. So, I mean, like, my, the pay is great, uh, the hours, I mean, could be better, but, you know, the pay is pretty great. So, um, I've been doing my best to put some money aside and whatnot, so, yeah, um, so $3,000, if you can, you know, donate some money, share it around, or do both, one or the other, do both. You know, the link is going to be somewhere, either in, on the video, maybe right there, or down below in the, in the description. So, yeah, um, but November 24th, pretty excited because it's, you know, top surgery and it's a consult. Uh, I low-key hope it's booked, or I'm booked for surgery within the next, like, couple months because I'm not going to be in school for uh, any, or at least any more.